Yeah, no, it's just, it's a, it's three boys in a dark room. I wonder what they're gonna do. Distracted, my toes are getting played with. Wait, who's there from the top? Oh, there's Jack. 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 Oh,
that's what it is. All right, okay. What is that face? I don't know. You need your diaper change? You want to check? Yeah. I think it's bearded. <laughs> Lane, your man's spread is glorious. Around the G spot? I think all of it does. <laughs> that does What's the G spot? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's mint. That's I'll myth. find the methiological clitoris. <laughs> I've seen That's it depicted. Be your first D &D mission. I feel like G strings. To find the clitoris! Off to find ah! the clitoris. Where is it located? In the deadliest place of all. <laughs> Wait. The Valley of Thieves. <laughs> the Valley of Cunts. Uh, Cunts? Cunts. 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 Does a D string just go over the hips more? Uh, I feel like in every like depiction I've seen of it, yes, because it's yeah. always been what was it, Lord of the G Strings? That was like that soft core lesbian porn that was yeah. available on like Netflix, uh, not Netflix, like Comcast back in the day for free. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Did yeah. that also shape your childhood? It was. Did mine? It, very soft core. It was very soft core. But it it. Like the nipple play was just. <laughs> it, 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 it fulfilled my two great loves at the time. One was the work of J.R.R. Tolkien, and the other <laughs> was lesbians. <laughs> yeah, I have to say, I was into both of those things at the time. Yes. You invented what you one on Grey. We do. We do. We do. Look at that. I'm still into both those things. <laughs> it's been a while since I watched the Lord of the Rings movie, but god damn did I watch all the special features. I need to show you I guys. actually watched the Lord of the Rings trilogy last weekend. Did you really? <laughs> Wait. I, I, Kayla and I were just sitting there making breakfast and was like, put something on. It was like, and it was a 12 I'm, gonna, hour I'm just going to throw on when they go into Moria. It'll be fine. We'll watch them just go into Moria. we are chased by some orcs. We'll eat breakfast and we'll do something else. And then it was nope. like, oh man. I got and then I got into a whole conversation about toxic masculinity comparing... Aragorn is just like, no, man, he's the best. He can go ahead, he can slay, he decapitates an orc. Yeah. And within 15 seconds, he's re reciting the poetry of his people's homeland to his dying brother. <laughs> and he's, he's got tears welling up in his eyes, making sure that his, his brethren dies well, knowing that he protected the people he needed to and their land will not fall. And he's crying and he's reciting poetry. He just decapitated the motherfucker 20 seconds ago. There's no toxic masculinity. Aragorn is just a badass. That's why he's king. He's just the coolest dude. Yeah, but what were his, like, political views? Uh, I mean, he brought peace throughout the land for over 100 years. You write that handsome man. He can do no wrong. <laughs> Fucking hated orcs, though. I mean, they brought it upon themselves by raping and pillaging. I need to show you guys, uh, Big Saucer's Pizza. I don't know if I want to know. So more time, the more just put up a fight. All right, I'm gonna start playing now. All right, sound check one. Wait, so, so we're good with it, or is this another sound check? No, I think we're good. We're good. You guys good? All right, take one. I don't remember the song. Okay. <laughs>